Hey gang, this is Max with Guitar Center. We're here at NAMM 2024. We just stopped by the Korg booth and we're chatting with Luciano. How you doing, Luciano? Very good. Excited to be here at day one. We just opened the show, so uh, great first interview. Awesome. Well, so we're looking at the new Grand Stage X. Do you want to tell us a little bit about it? Of course, yeah. So this new Grand Stage X is completely redesigned. So this is our newest flagship stage piano. Just from afar, you'll already notice a completely redesigned look. It has this beautiful curved design, perforated side panels. But really what's under the hood is also what makes this special. So we have the most diverse range of sounds in any stage piano, 700 to be complete, as well as seven sound engines borrowed from our workstations, Nautilus and Kronos. On the main panel as well, lots of really cool hands-on controls too. So that's the short of it. Nice. Well, can you tell us a little bit, for those that may not be as familiar with Kronos or Nautilus, what those seven engines are? Yeah, so basically if you're a player and you want to cover a wide range, like piano sounds, we have a dedicated sound engine. Electric piano sounds, there's another dedicated engine. Organ sounds and so on. So what these engines do is give you a wide variety of sounds and really defined nuances in each part of those sounds. So a piano might give you the mechanical key noises of the piano sound, uh, which is really great. <laughs> So obviously the name is Grand Stage. Certainly people can use this in the studio, they can use it for fun at home, but it's a stage piano. So what were the key considerations you wanted to factor into the design to make it stage friendly? So first thing you'll notice is the front panel now is angled up towards the player. And that's key because when you're on stage performing, you want to be able to quickly access the parameters. So completely redesigned for this Grand Stage X, we now have a centralized display, which I think is great because you immediately see what sound you have up. And now with the easy part control section, when you want to quickly split or layer the keyboard, you can see now I easily see what is in the split and I have a dedicated fader for each of those part controls. So I think essential for any stage piano is quick, easy control. And that's exactly what this main panel is aimed to do with this new angled design. So when we were talking a little earlier before the camera started rolling, you were showing me the effects section and the analog tone section as well. Can you talk a little bit about that? 100%. So let's start with the analog tone. So this is a, uses our new tube, which you might have heard from other Korg products. Um, but what is the value out of this? If you have uh, an electric piano sound, for example, and you want to get a little bit more bite on it and a little bit of that real analog distortion, I can come here, turn on my analog tone and season to taste uh, how much I want. So if I want a little more distortion, I can turn it up. Really useful feature, even for clav sounds, that can be a great addition. And EQ controls right on the main panel. So if I'm going through a sound system in a live setting, a little bit too much low end, turn on the EQ controls and adjust my low end, you know, whatever you want to do. So very cool. So very stage friendly, very performer friendly, clearly designed with the player in mind. I'm sure you've probably got some personal favorites on here. You want to give us a taste? Of course, yeah. A couple of really awesome sounds in here. All right, let's take a listen. Luciano, that sounded incredible. While you were playing, I noticed a few other controls we didn't touch upon. Can you tell us a little bit about those? Totally. So first starting with the unison, this will quickly thicken or fatten the sounds. So it basically gives you a nice wider stereo spread, gives you almost like a chorus effect, which is very useful. And below it, we have a rhythm section, which in a stage piano is something that is not really the industry standard. And what this is, it gives you accompaniment, bass that follows the chord changes you're playing, as well as a drum track. So you can choose from different rhythms that are built into the instrument. And finally, so useful is key touch. So it's a way to instantly adjust the dynamic level to give you more nuanced control over whatever sound you're playing on the grand stage. So I use that a lot, playing a ballad, want to desensitize the keybed a little bit, I can turn on the keys touch feature and adjust, season the taste. So three reasons that players are going to love this when they get it home. It's going to set you apart on stage, or if you're at home, it looks like an amazing piece. The easiest hands-on controls, so I think this new display is a real seller. And finally, 700 sounds in a stage keyboard is amazing, diverse variety. Uh, those would be my top three. Very cool. And perhaps most important, actually, when can players expect to start seeing this through local GC or online? Expecting uh, estimated around the summer of uh, 2024. Well, thank you so much, Luciano. We appreciate your time. 
And if you want to learn more about Grand Stage X or any of the other new exciting products at NAMM, follow us on YouTube or head over to guitarcenter.com. <laughs>